in last years we have seen many novelties about the therapies of multiple myeloma therapeutic panorama has greatly changed uh, thanks to the awakening of uh, immunotherapy but I think that is really important to focus about uh, the profiling of our patient starting from the biology but it's also important to study radiologically the patient and that's why with my institution Instituto di Namadori from Meldola in Italy we have decided to better study the biology and radiomic of our patient and uh, we uh, decided to include all our patients in a new multiomic approach in which we study their biology, their radiologic status, their metabolic pathways in order maybe one day to develop a new prognostic score and uh, to have a target driven approach that we totally need in multiple myeloma because we think that one fit for all is not anymore something that we have to use considering uh, the many drugs that we have available. However, uh, particularly we decided to uh, combine PET, FDG PET with whole body MRI to study all the newly diagnosed in the patient, all the pre-meloma status and particularly high risk smoldering meloma and all relapsed refractory patient. We have demonstrated that improving the diagnostic approach to our patient could really improve their outcome thanks to the potential upstaging or downstaging that we can do thanks to the combination of different diagnostic methods and particularly we could totally change the journey of our patient, changing the potential treatment when we include a combination of techniques that can in some way change the diagnostic scenario of our patient. I think this is really important because this can help us to optimize the drugs that we have available, to understand when a patient could be pretreated, for example, for Eric smoldering meloma inside the clinical trials, but also for elapsed refractory setting. In some way, we have some grade zone in which we have to understand which patient is to be treated, which one is to be uh, in some way observed, and I think that uh, this is a basis that we can solve improving our diagnostic tools. We will include in next evaluation also the biology patterns inside this trial. So this is uh, the first part of our multiomic uh, program that we are developing and I'm really happy to present this data in uh, Chicago on 4th June in uh, oral abstract sessions of multiple myeloma.